everybody do SRT Gang. This your boy with the fat swaggy reacts and we are back with another reaction video man and shout out to the homie Mr. Nightmare. Y'all knew this was coming. Yeah, yeah. I mean I mean, y'all knew this was coming. The second y'all seen him drop today you of course, of course I was gonna uh like you know like give you guys this reaction. Today we're gonna be checking out five freaking videos recorded by um, I'm, I'm like ring cameras and now now for the ones who do have like doorbell cameras or just cameras in general bro like make sure you guys are checking it daily because 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 like it's some weirdos out here it's just some weirdos out here that's that's constantly stalking like I mean that could be be like I'm like watching your every move to try to break into your crib that's why I always make sure my door is locked my my window is locked and 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 like you know like when we're going to bed everything is secured you feel me uh, I mean, and i hope you guys are doing the same now see we, oh, that way. so without further ado man let's go ahead and get into this thing like you guys checking this video out for the first time i drop one of these every night at 11 p.m so hit that subscribe button like join the family man and and tune in every night at, at 11 p.m man so without further ado let's get into it man let's go let's go yeah become extreme Home security, techno Home security technology has come a long way. Doorbell cameras such as Ring have become extremely popular in recent years, acting as an yeah. effective deterrent for- Yeah, they got Ring, um, um, they got, um, Vivid, they got, uh, at and I mean, like, um, I mean, like, I think it's like ATC or, or something like that, you know what I'm saying? They got, like, multiple different ones, man, so whatever ones you guys have, Salute the R, man. Such as Ring have become extremely popular in recent years, acting as an effective deterrent from potential robbers or any other kind of unwelcomed guests. Yep. Their ability to record video whenever someone comes within range to the front of a house or any other section of the house that they're installed in creates an added level of security to a person's home. With the millions of Ring doorbell cameras installed throughout America has come a lot of creepy footage, including the following. This first piece of footage was captured by the ring camera in the LeMay household. It happened on a cold December night in 2019. A stranger hacked into the LeMay family's ring security system and had watched them around their home. And for nearly 10 minutes, he interacted with 8-year-old Alyssa. Not only was he able to watch her, but he was able to communicate noises to her, as he had access what? to a second system placed in the girl's babysitter's room downstairs. Alyssa then heard music coming from upstairs in her bedroom, which she shared with her two sisters. See, this technology nowadays is getting ridiculous, bro. The people can hack into it to the point they can literally talk to you. Like, this is crazy right here, bro. This is crazy. The mu like, like, this is definitely, like, some music... Music that you hear on like on like a country farm, like somebody about to get killed, about to get. Know what I'm saying? Come on, man! Like Jeepers Creepers 2.0. <laughs> The music that was playing was the creepy song you probably recognize from the movie Insidious, "Tiptoe Through the Tulips." Thinking it was her younger sister playing the music to scare her, Alyssa wandered upstairs to her room as the creepy song blared from the ring camera. First, she couldn't figure out where the sounds were coming from. As you will see, she was picking up various objects in her room and putting them up to her ear to see if they were what was emanating the sounds and music. Melissa eventually realized someone was watching her in the bedroom because the blue light from the ring camera was blinking. Then, in a strange man's voice, she heard this. Hello there. The eight-year-old gasped and tried to figure out where the voice was coming from. She would pick up her toys to see if they were what was making the noises. She scanned the room, and moments later, the man started screaming a racial slur at her over and over, until Alyssa responded by screaming this. What? I can't hear you. I can't hear you. The 
man proceeded to tell her to go call her mom the racial slur and demand that she repeat it back to him. Moments later, the voice would reply to Alyssa asking who are you by saying he's her best friend, he's Santa Claus. Who is that? I'm your best friend. I'm Santa Claus. So this is exactly why, like, I don't keep, like, I don't keep stuff like this into my daughter's room, none of that, bro, because, like, even though my daughter know right from wrong, like, she know when, you know, certain things is not right or whatever to come get me, like, or her mom, like, like, we still try to avoid these type of situations, bro. It's crazy. I'm, I'm Santa Claus. Don't you want to be my best friend? I'm Santa Claus. After all of this, the man tries to tell the girl she can do whatever she wants, including break things in her room. I'm your best friend. You can do whatever you want right now. You can mess up your room. This is weirdo, man. You can break your TV. You can do whatever you want. The LeMay family, who resides in Memphis, Tennessee, hoped to use the device to keep an eye on their daughters while they played. The scary thing is that it took only a few days for the camera to be hacked. Perhaps the scariest thing is that no one knows how long he had access to the device. This could have gone on even longer if the hacker decided not to produce any sounds through the device. Put yourself in the little girl's shoes. Crazy. Imagine hearing a creepy song playing in your bedroom, not knowing where it's coming from, only to realize that it's coming from a camera system that you set up in there, and that someone could be watching you. Now imagine waking up to that in the middle of the night. Right. Right. In another similar scenario, here's the footage from a ring camera that was also taken over by a hacker who attempted to speak to a young girl while she was watching television. What you watching? See, no, nah, see, this is so weird. See, listen, bro. Like, if, I, if me personally, if I'm just sitting here watching something, then all of a sudden, I, uh, like, I hear a voice that I don't recognize. But y'all know what time it is, bro. They about to catch what? A few. Hot ones. I'm not playing no games. I'm shooting cameras, everything. I'm not playing. What? Man, listen. She was watching television. What you watching? Hey, what show is that? Like, we're the father and home? homeowner, Adam Kersalik, had set up the ring camera in his kitchen. In the footage, a voice can be heard speaking to his daughter after he momentarily leaves the room. I've seen that show before. It's weirdo. Young. Bro. Just people don't be having nothing better else to do, bro. Like weirdos, man. When Adam re enters the room and opens the fridge, the voice says, What are you eating? Hello? What are you eating? You hungry? He looks around at first, rightfully confused as to where the voice could be coming from, though he eventually catches on and approaches the camera as he asks, who is this? Adam disabled the camera shortly after the video ends, and he expressed his disappointment in Amazon's lack of security on their products. He said he was never advised to set up two-factor verification when he installed the camera six months prior. Because of the lack of security on the Ring devices, he has since taken down all his interior cameras. This and the Lemoy family's horror stories aren't the only ones of their kind though. As since 2019, over 10 other families in different states have reported That's that crazy. hackers have spoken to them through the devices. That's crazy. See, they gotta do better with this technology, bro. Yes, it's cool to have, but it's way, because clearly it's way too easy to hack into, bro. Way too easy. On November 12th, 2019, the disturbing footage of a woman screaming for help was captured from a Ring doorbell's camera in a small neighborhood of Los Angeles around 11 p.m. 
The screaming is followed by a white vehicle speeding down the street with the trunk open, from which the screaming is coming from. I think we've seen this one. Police were not aware of the doorbell footage until the following morning, but on the night of November 12th, they responded to a report of a possible kidnapping. Police couldn't find any evidence of a kidnapping at first. However, after the footage came to light, the LAPD reopened their investigation. A witness claimed she also heard a man say, I'm sorry, which you can hear in the video at one point. Yeah. The sad thing is, this was two years ago, and nothing ever surfaced with this. If this was an actual kidnapping, the kidnappy was never found. That's what I've been talking about, man. What? This was the footage captured around 3 a.m. on a man's ring camera. Not much more information than that was shared. However, multiple conclusions can be drawn from what's seen. It starts with a masked woman seemingly trying to enter the man's house until she notices the doorbell camera, at which point she stares into the camera for almost 40 seconds. Halfway into her disturbing gaze into the camera, she puts on a pair of goggle-type glasses and pulls the mask covering her mouth and nose up higher onto her face, clearly trying to mask her identity as much as possible. Before she walks away, she makes several hand gestures into the camera, then turns and appears to grab something from behind one of the walls of the house. she slowly walks away from the house, you might assume she's leaving for good. However, you can see she continues to pace back and forth in front of the house until the video hits the two-minute mark, at which point the doorbell camera is set to stop recording. After the video ends, however, according to neighbors, the woman was seen standing outside the house for at least another 20 to 30 minutes before finally disappearing. It's not known who this woman was, whether it be a crazy stalker ex-girlfriend or someone completely random. This begs the question, what could she have wanted with the owner of the house? Is but given everything the woman was wearing from head to toe, it's obvious she came to that house with intentions of masking her identity. Exactly. So, she, she obviously wanted to break in, but, like, this, this is exactly why, like, I'm not keep my stuff armed at all times, because people are crazy. They will literally come in the middle of your house in broad daylight. They don't care. Like, people are crazy, bro. Like, I don't know. Why is a question that may never be answered. It's crazy to me, man. And with this last one, we see a scene that seems like it was taken straight from one of the hundreds of stories I've read on the channel. Once again, at some off hour in the night, a woman approached the front door of a Reddit user's dad's friend's house somewhere on the east coast of the United States. The woman seems to have a slight smile on her face at first, as she looks around the front door of the house all confused. Is that a knife? She stands there for two full minutes at least. Is that a knife she has in her hand? Around the front door of the house all confused like. She stands there for two full minutes at least, acting nervous and confused, looking behind her several times in a paranoid manner. But what is most concerning about this unexpected visit was the large kitchen knife in her hand that she looks down at several times in the footage. Oh my god, what is she planning on doing with that? While the generally accepted theory on this was that the woman has some form of dementia, and while this may be a realistic explanation, this cannot be 100% confirmed simply based on the video. While it is unfortunate if she does in fact have dementia or any other sort of illness that caused her to do this, it would still be hard to imagine just how scary this would be for the owner of the house waking up in the middle of the night to this footage from his doorbell camera. And that's exactly what I be saying. If anybody bring my doorbell at any time in the night, bro, knowing damn well we sleep, bro, listen, you gon' Man, listen, dog. I'm not playing no games, dog. Would be for the owner of the house waking up in the middle of the like, night no to way. this footage from his doorbell camera. Mm -hmm.
Surveillance cameras in general have come a long way in providing security to people's properties. For real. While ring doorbell cameras continue to prove to be useful in adding a layer of defense or serving as a mental deterrent to uninvited guests, you clearly have to be cautious about setting up these cameras on the inside of your house because of the potential for hackers to gain access to them, for real. as seen in the first two examples in this video. For real, bro. Like, for real, like, like, if you guys, if any of you guys have any, like, type of security system, bro, just, 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 like, really pay attention to it, man. Like, really just try to, try to, like, do what you can so it don't get hacked. But at the same time, it's like, it's like people literally, like, don't have no lives. And they literally just do that, like, just because they are lonely. Like, 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 they're weird. They're weird. They pre like they prey on children. They play like 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 all this crazy stuff, bro. But shout out to Mr. Nightmare, man. Like if you guys have a doorbell camera or just a security system in general, or whatever. Like who do you guys have? I'd be interested in knowing that. And make sure you guys are tuned in tomorrow when I drop another one at 11 p.m. Gang at S R T Gang. I am out this thing, man. Let's get it.